أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم Concerning what are they disputing? Concerning the great news about which they cannot agree Verily they shall soon come to know Verily, verily they shall soon come to know Have we not made the earth as a wide expanse and the mountains as pegs And have we not created you in pairs, and made your sleep for rest, and made the night as a covering, and made the day as a means of subsistence? And have we not built over you the seven firmaments, and placed therein a light of splendor? And do we not send down from the clouds water in abundance, that we may produce therewith corn and vegetables? and gardens of luxurious growth. Verily, the day of sorting out is a thing appointed, the day that the trumpet shall be sounded, and you shall come forth in crowds, and the heavens shall be opened as if there were doors, and the mountains shall vanish as if they were a mirage. Truly, hell is as a place of ambush, For the transgressors, a place of destination. They will dwell therein for ages. Nothing cool shall they taste therein, nor any drink. Save a boiling fluid, and a fluid dark, murky, intensely cold. A fitting recompense for them. For that they use not to fear any account for their deeds. But they impudently treated our signs as false. And all things have we preserved on record. So taste you the fruits of your deeds, for no increase shall we grant you except in punishment. Verily, for the righteous there will be a fulfillment of the heart's desires. Gardens enclosed and grapevines. Companions of equal age. And a cup full to the brim. No vanity shall they hear therein, not untruth. Recompense from your Lord a gift amply sufficient. From the Lord of the heavens and the earth and all between, Allah most gracious, none shall have power to argue with him. The day that the Spirit and the angels will stand forth in ranks, none shall speak except any who is permitted by Allah most gracious, and he will say what is right. That day will be the sure reality. Therefore, whoso will, let him take a straight return to his Lord. Verily, we have warned you of a penalty near, the day when man will see the deeds which his hands have sent forth, and the unbeliever will say, Woe unto me, would that I were mere dust.